Good morning. Trustees have given the go-ahead for name changes for Cole Tyee Elementary School and the NDSS sports field. The new name for the school is Sue Winst, and the sports field will be Key Kinishtuk, though both will be listed officially in the original Indigenous alphabet. Thank heaven for rainy day funds in cases of unexpected costs. The city is dipping into the reserve funds to cover rising costs of the Midtown Gateway Road alignment and the Midtown Water Supply projects. More than 4.8 million in budget increases for the projects were approved by city council on Monday. And city council meetings will be streamed live during the October election. Staff had recommended going off air during the campaign, but a motion to that effect failed on a 4-4 tie vote. Chief Election Officer Sheila Gurry said the recommendation was out of fairness to all candidates and also to try to ensure that the councillors and the public stick to council business at the meetings. And if you're still waiting for the $110 gasoline rebate from the province, stand in line. Millions of drivers are waiting for the rebate to make up for the record high gas prices. ICBC said about 3.5 million rebates will be issued, but the latest update shows more than 2.5 million haven't received the rebate yet. The investigation into President and former Nelson Police Department members by the Office of the Police Complaint Commissioner raises some serious questions. Details are still sketchy, but the investigation was initiated by the chief of that department. So no matter what the outcome, a massive upheaval is likely the end result. Enjoy the weekend and keep an umbrella handy, at least until Monday.